rest about a sum for each number line model. For review, if we are adding two numbers, the two numbers we are adding are called the add-ins. The result of the addition is the sum. Because both models have two arrows, we know we have two add-ins, where the first add-in is indicated by the arrow starting at zero, or the blue arrow, and then the second add-in is indicated by the second arrow or the red arrow. Looking at the first model, because the blue arrow starts at zero and jumps to two, two is the first add-in, which means we have two plus. Now we need to be careful about the second add-in. Notice how the second arrow or red arrow starts at two and jumps to nine. Nine is not the second add-in, nine is the sum, which means we now know two plus the second add-in is equal to nine. To determine the second add-in, indicated by the red arrow, we need to determine how many units we moved from two to nine. So starting at two, we count the number of units to nine. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We moved seven units to the right of two, which means seven is the second add-end, giving us the addition problem, two plus seven equals nine. Another way to think of this model is two increased by seven is nine. Looking at the second example, we need to be a little bit careful about the number line. Notice how it's labeled every two units with tick marks every one unit. For the first add end, looking at the blue arrow starting at zero, notice how we start at zero and jump to seven, which is not labeled, but let's go ahead and label it. Seven is the first add end, which means we have seven plus the unknown second add end equals, looking at the red arrow, which indicates the second add end, notice how it ends at 18, which is not the second add end, it's the sum. To determine the second add end, we need to determine how far we move to the right from seven to get to 18. So starting at seven, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11 units which means 11 is the second add end, giving us the addition problem, seven plus 11 equals 18. This model also shows seven increased by 11 is 18. I hope you found this helpful.